In this video, I'll be talking about one of the best email marketing platform, which is for the email automation as well. And it is for the marketing automation. So if I go here, syncpix.com, I have provided the link in the description also for this particular platform, recommended platforms, and this is best email marketing platform. So I'll click here, it will open. Bravo is one of the best platforms which is available right now for the email marketing, email automation and all of that. Right now I'm using s4stechnology.com which is my website. My emails are routed to my Gmail account using Cloudflare and if you want to know how to set up that I have provided the link in the description where you can understand that how we can route our emails to personal email without having the email server. So if we are not having any email service we can still route our emails at our domain name.com to our Gmail account or any other account. So which is free of course you don't need to pay anything here. The problem here is that from my Gmail account, when I try to send the email, it will be sending as Gmail, which doesn't look professional. For that, we'll be configuring Bravo. Bravo will help you not only to use this as a sending email, but you can also use this for the marketing, for the conversation. You can also do the transactional email, which will be automatically going. So I'll be clicking on sign up for free. So don't forget to use the link, which I have provided in the description. By this, you can support this channel. So I'll click sign up for free and in sign up for free I'll be using official email which will be of course info at s4stechnology.com and I'll create an account and now the verification email will go to my email and as you know that my email is being routed from my info at s4stechnology.com to thinkpricks at gmail.com so I'll be receiving it here and if you see here that email has come from Bravo and I'll be confirming my email address to complete this registration and now I'll be entering my name here and this is s4s technology and here I'll be typing in the website s4s technology I'll be typing in the address how many contacts do you have I have one only so I'll be choosing this for the time being do you sell online yes I would love to receive the product updates and and once you get the email verification code you will be all set so you can choose the plans here so there are different plans which are available it's when you will start sending the e-commerce email and marketing emails I would recommend you to go for this particular plan which is $65 per month with unlimited contacts you can have unlimited contacts but of course there is 20,000 mails per month which you can send and there is marketing automation A-B testing advanced statistics and all of this is available so in case you want to have the unlimited contacts and enterprise grade security and there are various things available which is tailored for your business needs you can use Bravo Plus and you can talk to their sales team so they will help you on that but right now I'll be going for free because for the test purpose but of course I'll be upgrading the plan the moment my store has started getting the business so I'll be just clicking on sign up for free and now you can see here there is total one contact which is available right now now before you start using it you need to make sure that you complete your settings here first of all go to security and ensure that you have enabled the two-factor authentication I'll enable the two-factor authentication from where I'm logged in I'll be able to see it from here in case you want to authorize the specific IPs that only those IP will be able to access this account click on authorized IPs and you can allow authorized IPs Salmon is available only for the enterprise accounts so right now I'll not be using that in my profile you want to change the password and all of that you can do it from here and here plugins and integration in case you want to integrate it with any external plugin you can integrate with WordPress and WooCommerce that I'll show you that I have shown you already how to do that and the link is provided in the description where I have explained you how you can set up the WordPress website and how you can set up the complete e-commerce store you can also do the Google contact management also by Bravo so I'll not be using that so I'll be just going here right now and you can see here senders domain and dedicated IPs I will not be using any dedicated IP but I will be configuring my domain here make sure that you add the domain here I'll be going here to add domain and here I'll be choosing s4s technology.com who is the email provider so I'll be choosing other here and save the domain so now it will ask me to authenticate the domains I need to provide the txt records here and cloudflare I'll be going to dns I'll add first record here it should be txt record and it should be at txt it will be at and what will be that record it will be this one I'll copy here and paste it here now this particular record is added I'll just save it here so one record is added and there is another record also that I need to add as a DKIM record mail domain key so I'll be adding another txt record so add a record it will be again txt record mail underscore domain key and I'll be adding this and save the record two txt records which were required by Bravo has been added now I'll just click 
authenticate this email domain and it will look for the domain records and now you can see here that the domain S4S technology is successfully authenticated. And if I look for the TXT record now, TXT records are also added here. Bravo code has been added. The benefit of Cloudflare is that it propagates the, all the DNS records immediately to most of the DNS servers you see here into domain. So my domain is authenticated. So I'll be going back again to home page and here senders domain dedicated IP. So I'll not be using dedicated IP. It is reserved for the marketing and transaction email. I'll be clicking on sender and in sender you can see here that default right now which is verified is info at thinkbricks.com which means that I can send now the emails using info at syncbricks.com. And if I click here again on the right side, you can see here SMTP and API. So I can use the API and SMTP ID. So master password is available here. So you can use master password. The SMTP relay server is smtp-relay.bravo.com and port is 587 and the login information is this. So you can generate a new SMTP key in case you want to use the API key. So documentation is available here for the email campaigns. You can use that. So this was setup of the domains which we have done. In case you want to add more users, you can add more users. Right now, one user is there who is the owner. So plugin and integration, I have shown you how to add it to WordPress website. If I show you the menu here, in menu, you can see here context, campaigns, automations, transactions, conversation, deals, and meet. So context, you can have all your context which will be added. It will be loaded here. So you can create multiple groups here. So in case you want to have the groups, so you will be clicking here and list. You can see here your first list. You can start adding different groups over here. So in segments, these are all the segments, inactive email subscriber, all email subscribers. And now here you can create the forms where you want the people to subscribe to email list. For example, I'll create my first email subscription form and here I'll be giving it a name, subscribe to mailing list. I enable the GDPR field also. And here you can start designing your form. I will not make any changes in case you want to make the changes to meet your theme requirements, color theme. So you can do that in case you want to add image. So you can bring in image, for example, logo and all of that. Here is as for as logo and I'll be uploading. In case you want to add the background image, you can do that. And I'll click next. And you have to enable the recapture also to avoid the spamming. And here list in which particular list these emails will be added. So I'll create a list, I will mention it. List name is subscribers from website and I will create this list here into my first folder. So my list has been created inside the first folder. The contacts who will be added from this will be added to my subscribers from the website. I'll click next. And now it is the double confirmation. I'll send no confirmation email and next. Once the form is filled, it will say your subscription has successful so in share, you can use this as an iframe or you can use this as an HTML or you can use simple HTML or you can even copy this URL and you can directly start adding the context here. You can see here that here the subscriber will start adding it here. For example, I'll be adding, I agree to receive the email and subscribe. Now, of course, once I click this, the email ID will be added to my lists. If I go here to lists, the subscriber email has automatically added here but subscriber will not receive any email. And you will see here that there is no email which has come from S4S technology because the automation is not done here. So you can even do the automation. If I go here to automation, so you can start creating the automation also that if one person is subscribed to the email list, that person should automatically get an email. In the automation, you can see here, these are the default templates which are available. So one template is for double opt-in confirmation and then simple confirmation, final confirmation, unsubscribe follow-up email. You can change the template. So in case you want to change the template design, you can edit the content. And So I'll be going to email templates, create a new email template and I'll give it the name welcome to S4S technology and it will be a website subscriber and subject line will be welcome to S4S technology newsletter and I'll mention here preview text will be thank you for subscribing and from email will be S4S technology it will be going from there you can add a new sender also but I'll be giving it a name later so you can also change it here from S4S technology you can mention for example S4S or you can give any other name the name of the sender I will leave everything default here and I'll click next now here the layout so I'll be choosing a simple layout here you can start with the blank layout or you can start with the normal layout or if you have the products and services so you can use that so I'll be using simple one right now just for the sake of this tutorial and here and in case you want to add the logo also here so here you can add image so insert the logo you can resize it 
align left and here you can see this will be the email that will be going so dear customer thank you for subscribing to our newsletter and you can of course customize it later so i'll be just saving it here you can see this is the mail which will go okay now we'll save and activate this now what has happened that template has been activated now and see here the template is activated if i go here to template so you can see welcome to s4s technology website subscribe under campaign the templates will be there but i want to automate this if i see here automation in automation i'll create the first automation these are various automations here cart is abandoned on your e-commerce store so somebody is purchasing the product so immediately you will send the email if there is an anniversary date or birth date email will automatically go to the customer marketing activity if there is any campaign so these are most popular of course there are various other automations that you can use for improving the engagement for increasing the traffic for increasing the revenue or building the relationships now if i see here this welcome message will show you the flow so what will be the entry point if you remember we created this subscriber mail list so entry point is that if somebody is subscribing to the newsletter so that person should automatically get the email which we just created so i can use this automation i'll just close it i will not use this i will create a custom automation so what will be custom automation create here a welcome email for newsletter and here i'll create the automation and here i'll start the entry point here so now you can see here these are all the entry points for your workflow so it could be if there is any website activity an event happens or any contact is submitted to a form or any contact activity or any email activity i'll be choosing contact details once a contact is added to a list so what is that list we mentioned here that subscriber from website the subscriber is added to the list this is the entry point now what should happen exit and restart the workflow no this should not exit and restart workflow it should do something else so what it will do i will send an email so what email will be sent these are all the templates so i'll be choosing welcome to s4s technology and you want to receive the hidden copy or not so i'll not use that so i'll be clicking okay and now in case you want to delay also so you can add the delay here you can see condition add a delay wait until if then else condition and all of that so i'll be adding a delay for example if you want to add a delay of one minute so we can add the delay of one minute now what will happen that the moment email is added to the list it will wait for one minute and then it will send the email so i'll activate this automation now you can see here that this particular activation is automated so this was welcome so in case you want to change it so you can change the description welcome email to newsletter subscriber there so what will happen first of all once this contact is added here it will wait for one minute it will send the email it will close and it will wait for another action now if i go back here this is the first automation which has been added and now i'll go back again here to list i'll remove this id here and i'll start adding and again and more action delete permanently i'll type one here so it will help me to delete this if you go back to lists you can see here that subscriber from website there is no person added i'll just go back again here to the form which i created and in this form i will now add the subscriber so i'll be adding the subscriber and subscribe now if you see here that the person has been added to the list and if you see the automation part right now it has started you can see here started one finished zero you can see the same email has come and this time it has come from info at s4stechnology.com and i can reply back to info at s4stechnology.com now you can see here that without having any email server so we have configured so similarly in case you want to create a campaign so i'll click on campaign and create a new campaign it will be an email campaign and i'll choose the campaign name for example it will be summer offer and i'll create a campaign and to which list you want to send this email to i want to send to all the subscriber from website i'll save it now next step is that i need to add the subject get 50 percent off during this summer we have exclusive decision and i'll click save now next step will be designing the email content so i'll start designing it here so you will choose the template here now for example i want to use this particular template i'll be adding the logo again here you can set up the brand here so now you can see here that my brand and my website has been added save and apply brand and i'll continue editing the content now so you can see here that logo has been added and i'll be choosing here promote the product here i will tell that summer sale 50 percent off on laptop i'll be choosing the product here i'll be inserting this and i'll mention the details of this product so here is the product details so here you'll be adding call to action so call to action will be the product link and here is the product link so this will be link title insert now you can see all of 
that is added so my email campaign is ready now so i'll be saving now if you see here that these are the steps in case you want to track this with the google analytics you can do that so in case you want to remove this uh, bravo logo of course you can upgrade the plans plan so your bravo logo will be removed now you can schedule this to a specific date and time depending upon the season and it is recommended to send it by 11 o'clock during the daytime because most of the people they check the emails by 11 o'clock and this is the analysis which people have done but for the sake of this tutorial i'll be using send now in the campaign it will show me how many people have received it what is the status and all of that see this more so summary timeline and all of that so i can just skip this tour i can see how many emails are opened how many are clicked and how many are unsubscribed so i'll be waiting for the email to reach to my inbox and i'll show you how it looks like so i'll just check it here you can see that email has come from s4s technology so email campaigns are configured using the campaign it has the sms campaign also whatsapp campaign also push notifications also can be sent on the web you can also link it with the facebook ads whatsapp templates automation templates and then the transactional and conversational email and then the transactional which i told you that once the automation is done so that is also transactional so one event was there it was delivered and it was opened by the person you can see the statistics here also in bravo you can have the chatbot also configured so the chat widget can be installed i have shown you that in a different video that how you can set up the bravo chatbot in your website so you can click here choose the image here you can choose branding you can choose the logo and now you can see here chatbot is now ready so this way you will be able to use this so we'll be simply copying this bravo conversational code or we can set up the plugin so in that plugin it will automatically be available so i have explained you in a full tutorial how to create the website how to create the e-commerce website and how to set up all these plugins in that i have also explained you how to set up all these transactional emails with the woocommerce and e-commerce so all the e-commerce transactions can be taken care of in case you are using in the automation so sales automation task automation and deal automation can be used here and i have explained you in that in a separate Video. you can also set up the meetings with the help of bravo meetings so bravo meeting was also helping you to configure all of that start using bravo for making the call you can have your own customized number and it is not only email marketing platform it's a complete digital marketing platform which is not only helping you to integrate with email marketing but also sms marketing whatsapp marketing push notifications on web facebook ads there are various templates available and you can do the automation and automation will also be done for the newsletters for the birthday calendars and all of that transactional you can create any templates conversational you can have of course the chat bots configured chat widget configured for your website deals and meetings can also be logged here and calls can also be logged here. this was all about bravo if you want to subscribe to bravo account don't forget to use the link which i have provided in the description because you will get exclusive offer which is available to syncpix.com you will get a great deal and don't forget to watch the related videos. So see you in next video. Take care and goodbye.